Welcome back to Love and Junk Food. I'm Laura. I'm John. And today we're talking about our food favorites. All right, so it's been a minute since we've done one of these chatty, talky, get to know us kind of videos. And we like to play little games, ask little questions, and we hope that you will play along. A lot of times people do, and sure. we really love that. Yeah, we do. So in the comments, we ask questions. There's usually a question of the day or a talking point or whatever. And sometimes we have you ask us questions in the comments about, well, what is your favorite this or that today? We're gonna answer some of those and dive into a couple others that I thought of or I saw on the internet. So that's what the video is about. Okay. It is your favorite favorite it is black and white okay there is no um well i also like that i'm i'm saying this more to myself because uh, uh, sometimes I'm it's hard the message too though sometimes it's it's difficult for me to pick my absolute favorite you yeah, know me too so anyway all right all right are you ready i i guess so Let's first one is easy breezy i know mine so you say i think i know yours yeah, okay. Um, maybe we should play that game. Yeah, maybe we should. <laughs> um, I have a feeling it is the same, though. <laughs> uh, I think my favorite is your favorite. Ready? Okay. Sure. Fast food chain. Taco Bell. Taco Bell. And that is what I, I knew for you. Yeah. Would you know that That's for me? That's easy. Yeah. You know what's so sad? We tried to get Taco Bell last night. We did. And you know what's sad about Taco Bell? They're open later than most restaurants we're still having issues in our area are you where you live there's a lot of even just like subway and sandwich shops that you wouldn't think need a lot of you know you don't need a line cook or a chef right, or a, right. you know whatever um they're closing early and uh it's like taco a bell, yeah and it's a lot of places like that but taco bell stays open late you know what the problem is Every, it's the only place in town. Yeah, so if you goes there. want late night food, even you know between nine, ten thirty, or whatever, it's packed. There's a line. Always, yep. always. Okay, favorite ice cream flavor. First, before you say it, do you know? Do you think you know mine? Your favorite ice cream? Yeah, don't uh, say flavor. it. But do you think? I don't know. I think I know. I yours. think I know yours too. Do you, should we do that? Let's say each other's favorite. Okay. Ready? Go. Yeah. Vanilla. Red chip. <laughs> Am I right? Uh, yeah, pretty much. That is my favorite. <laughs> Mint chip. Um, for you. No. No? Oh. But that's probably my second favorite, but we said we weren't going to talk about that. Um, cookie dough. Oh, cookie dough. I should have known. It's that. not even the bits of cookie dough. It is brown sugar ice cream. It's so good. It's the ice cream part yeah, that I love true. of cookie dough. All right? Which, in fact, if I ever go to the store and I am getting cookie dough ice cream, and this is for future John, you have to read the container. Because sometimes it's vanilla ice cream with cookie dough chunks. Yeah. And sometimes it's brown sugar ice cream with, like, chocolate chips and sometimes chunks in it, too. Yeah, and you but really like that brown sugar brown ice sugar cream. Brown sugar ice cream. Yeah. Otherwise, I'm disappointed. <clears throat> yeah. Okay? Okay, next, favorite breakfast food. What is my go-to, my favorite, favorite breakfast food to order? You guess mine, I'll guess yours. Okay. I got it. See, for you, my guess would be biscuits and gravy, but I don't know. Oh. I'm also thinking, like, waffles, pancakes. Oh, boy. I love all or that Or donuts. He loves everything <laughs> breakfast. I know yours, though. What is it? Eggs Benedict. For sure. For sure. Somebody recently said in the comments, you should try it. Oh, she has. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. In every form, you know, when you... Oh, I don't even like breakfast that much, but you know when you go to a restaurant and if there's a riff on Benedict and they yeah. do something different, right. I have to. I have to. Yeah. What about you? Uh, chicken fried steak and eggs. I love it. Chicken fried steak is one of my favorite dinners. Oh, yeah, because you can have it for dinner, too. With, like, I love it with mashed potatoes. And... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, good one. All right, next, favorite fruit. I'll guess yours, and you guess mine. Okay. I'm going to guess banana. Hmm, wrong. <laughs> for you, I'm going to guess orange. Wrong. What? No. 
people of the world, <laughs> or at least the, the few that watch our channel, they're all screaming, pineapple! Oh, sh Sugar. <laughs> um, what is yours then, orange? Yeah, I like orange. Orange yeah. is my favorite. I just yeah. see you eat bananas more than anything else. I feel like no, that's- they're so much easier to eat. <laughs> yeah, especially for a little monkey. All right, next all right. is favorite sandwich. Boy, that's... You, you guess mine and I'll guess yours. I'm ready. Sandwich? Yeah. Oh, boy. Uh, I don't have a clue. How, how I, dumb am I? I, I don't... Pretty dumb. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna, just kidding. I, for you, I'm going to say BLT. Oh. The problem is John, I think, maybe doesn't know his either. Yeah, that's <laughs> He doesn't the know thing. mine and he doesn't I'm know his. Like, yeah, you're right. I really do like those. Uh, yeah, yeah. I, that's I, my I guess, guess that's for you is BLT. Right. Sure. Okay. Uh, I don't know if that's my favorite. Because I love a good cheesesteak. Oh, my oh, God. Oh, yeah. So good. He does. Um, so, I don't know. It's kind of a toss-up between the two. But you said it's black and white. I have to choose one. I'll, I'll say cheesesteak. Okay. Um, I really don't have a clue for you. I don't. Fried bologna sandwich. No, Reuben. Uh, oh, Reuben, that's right. That's my favorite favorite. Okay, favorite pasta dish. I know yours. I know yours. I think you know mine. <laughs> Ready? Yours is Alfredo. Yours is Betty carbonara. Alfredo. Carbonara is my favorite. Yep. Ding, ding. Okay, favorite cookie homemade. Oh, I think I know yours. Okay, and I think I know yours. I'm going to say for you, million dollar. And I'm going to say for you, sugar. You are correct. You are correct as well. Nice. Now favorite, <laughs> now favorite cookie store bought. Oh. These are, and by the way, the rules we're playing by are going into a store, things we can get here, you know, not yeah. in the entire world. So... If I were going into a store and going to get a cookie for you, a store-bought cookie, I would say double stuffed Oreo. And if I was going in to get one for you, I would get Chips Ahoy. It's my second favorite. It and is. sometimes that's really what I want. E.L. Fudge double stuffed oh, is my favorite Oh, E.L. Favorite. Fudge, those yeah. are good. Yeah. Those yeah. Okay. Cake. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Uh, what is your favorite? I know, I mean, obviously I know mine. Yeah. I don't know what I want to, I don't, yeah, I think I know. I, maybe. All right. All right. I'm going to say tiramisu, but is that considered, I mean, it's. I don't know that if that's, I would say that too, if that was considered a cake, but I don't know that it is. I know cake is a component. Yeah. So Our I'm going to say. Yeah. Over there. Uh, yeah. So I don't. I'm gonna say tiramisu for you, and I know that that is your favorite. Uh, what is my favorite? Yours. I'll say coconut cake. Coconut is my favorite. Ah. Okay. What is each other's favorite thing to cook? Oh boy. Kind of thing or whatever you know. Uh huh. For you, I'm gonna say soup. Soup is my favorite thing to cook. I love the whole, I feel like an alchemist <laughs> when I make soup. Yeah, you know? there's like little explosions and... <laughs> a big mess. I mean, I just love that whole like taking simple ingredients and scraps of things and making a broth and figuring it out as I go along. It's usually an all day process. I love that. Yeah, it's delicious. For you, I'm gonna say grilling, grilling meat. Yeah. Yeah, grilling or smoking. Yep, for sure. Yeah, yeah I do love that. Okay. Tastes so good. Um, what? This is easy. Soda. Yours is Cherry yeah, Coke yours Zero. Yours is Diet Mountain Dew. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's easy enough. Anybody okay. who said that. Favorite thing to dip a French fry in? <laughs> that's there easy. has to be something. For you, yours is easy. Do you know mine? Mine's easy too? I mean, it's easy for you to say mine, but I don't know. I, I'll, I'll just take a guess on yours. Yours is ranch. I'm going to say yours is ranch, too. No. Oh, no. I'm going to say mayo. When I want to dip, I'm going to say mayo. Oh, okay. Actually, my favorite thing is a little cup of mayo and a little cup of ketchup. 
if I'm gonna dip, which I usually don't. I really just like salty, oily fries. Um, but so, some of them I want to dip in ketchup and some I want to dip in mayonnaise. Uh, we are going to be doing a video about food crimes in the future. And one of them that came up, so if you know any food crimes, let us know. We'll talk about this later. But one of them that came up are the heathens of the world that take their french fries and squirt like oh, their yeah. ketchup and whatever, yeah. like all over their fries. I've never eaten fries like that. That's I am a, definitely a single crime. fry dipper kind of a person. I'm just teasing. You, you eat your fries however you want to. <laughs> um, favorite pizza topping, sauce and cheese excluded. Sauce and cheese excluded, okay. Like if I order pizza, I want it to have blank. I know yours, yours is easy. easy. I know yours, yours is easy. It is, okay. Yours is pepperoni. Yours is mushrooms. For sure, yeah, yeah good job. That's right, that's okay. right. Okay. <laughs> Favorite Asian dish? Oh boy. Like go-to order. Yeah, I, I think I know yours. The question is, do, do know? I know mine? <laughs> you know, it's one of those things. It depends. Um, I'm going to say sushi for you. Oh. But yeah. I mean, like, but that's different than like hot food. It just yeah. depends on what you're hungry for. But that's what I would say. Yeah, I love sushi. That's for sure. That's probably is my tops. But like if it was going for Chinese, I'd love a good, good garlic, uh, like garlic chicken. Yeah, I love garlic chicken too, especially the restaurants that put like the big mushrooms in. I love those. What's yeah. mine? Um, yours, I'll say uh, like fr fried rice, house fried rice. House fried rice with multiple proteins. Yes, that is it. And by the way, if you make fried rice at home, d don't skip the eggs. I feel cheated. I like to have like scrambled <laughs> eggs in my fried rice. Um, favorite dessert, like general category. <sighs> I, I mean, I guess, Hmm. Do you know what I mean by that? Yeah. Kind like, of dessert, yeah. not Ice specific. Ice cream cake yeah. or, you know. Yeah. Um, Gosh. <laughs> That's really hard for you. He loves them all, huh? Oh, I do. Love me some desserts, that's for sure. But it's even hard because I can't figure out what your favorite is. It's easy, I think. I'm going to say cake for you. Yeah, I think you're right. I'm going to say... Hmm. Oh, actually, there's two that that are really, really, really close. I'll say ice cream for you. I think that's what I would say, too. But second, even though we're not talking about it, cookies. Oh, love cookies. You know, like, go to a bakery where they have a big, soft, baked something with yep. icing? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Um, okay, almost done. Favorite dish you, that our moms made? You mm. have talked about, I can give you a hint if you don't know. For um, yours? Yeah. Oh. Or do you I, think you I know th it? I think I know. I, you have told me the story about your mom making, is it, is there a Hawaiian something? Oh yeah, there was Hawaiian chicken. I've heard you talk that about that specifically, and I've heard you talk about her baked things, like at, mm -hmm. at Christmas, I, those are the two things I feel like you talk about more than anything but I don't know you tell me I think one of the things that I miss the most is her spaghetti oh yeah I don't I love you mom but I don't miss your spaghetti. <laughs> yeah. my my dad would always be like Laura go doctor that up um sp your mom made good spaghetti yeah huh? for you I would say the pork and sauerkraut yeah I was gonna say the hint would be I make it yeah no. yeah my favorite meal in the world is pork roast and she would like cook it and turn it in the you know on the stove top to get some color and then finish baking it in the oven sauerkraut on top like to flavor the meat and then you um make dumplings and mashed potatoes yeah oh my gosh that sounds really good right. yeah my mom would always make spaghetti and she would just make it all you know from scratch and everything not the noodles of course but you know the sauce and it always to me it had like its own flavor i mean it was always very similar to other spaghettis but there was just something else to it and it wasn't you know it was years ago one of my friends made 
spaghetti and he spent all day on the sauce and when i tried it i was like this tastes like my mom's mm -hmm. spaghetti i was like what's the recipe what'd you do to it and he's like i don't know something different every time that's the thing <laughs> that's whenever i show a picture of like soup people are like how you know can you post the recipe yeah mm -hmm. i wish i could just take a you know a card out of my head yeah, and, it's more of a process right? yeah for sure yeah and i do think spaghetti sauce is the same way yeah you, right you taste it you season it yeah okay favorite vegetable not including not potatoes you know we'll say that's a starch okay your favorite vegetable i'm gonna say corn i'll say carrots for you kind of I mean, yeah. my favorite vegetable actually is mushrooms. Oh. But you don't usually okay. have mushrooms like on the side. I mean, I don't know. I do. Mushrooms usually ends up being an ingredient in something rather than on the side. So right. a vegetable on the side, carrots, roasted carrots in particular. Yeah. Yeah. yeah roasted carrots are very, very good. But I think you're right with me. I, corn, I think is probably the favorite. I always say my dad didn't like carrots, and so every time I went to my grandparents' house, I would ask for carrots. My grandma literally opened a can of carrots, and, and I would just go on and on about how much <laughs> I love them. Yeah, because I never got to have them at home. Um, okay, favorite way to eat a potato. I guess not favorite way to eat one. Not favorite way to cook. Favorite way to enjoy a potato. Like, do you want it mashed, baked, oh, fried? Oh, okay. Oh, you know, boy. you go to a steakhouse and they say, how do you want your potato? At a steakhouse? That's different than well, my, my I know, favorite way. But I'm though. saying, fa how I mean, do you like your potato? I, it, for me, it depends on what it's on the side of. That's right. It does. But if I were just going to eat potatoes, for you, I, th I would say mashed. Mm, I do like a good mashed. Um, I guess, I guess fries though. Is your favorite? I think so. Okay. I mean, if they're done well, you know, like some fries are no good. But yeah, there's a lot of cheap, not so great fries. But like, I, like fries. I understand what you're saying about like, depends on what it's on the side of, because if I had a steak, I would necessarily choose fries. I, Sometimes uh, that's a fries thing though. Right, but you know, yeah, it is a thing. They gotta um, be steak fries though. I would do I like mashed potatoes with steak, you know, that would be my favorite for that. Or not mashed potatoes, baked potato. You know, jacket potato, as some people call it. Mm -hmm. um, mashed goes good with other things, like that pork and sauerkraut. You know what's funny is if I were just going to eat just a potato, a lot of times I'll bake a potato and put like cheese and whatever and just eat a potato. And I really like it that way. And sometimes you put chili on it or whatever. Yeah. But I never just eat potatoes the other any of the other ways. Oh, and a hash brown. Oh, a hash brown. Mike. What's my favorite though? Uh, bum, bum, bum. I'll say mashed. Mashed. For sure. That's, yes, for sure. Um, what is your go-to sick food? Mine is easy, I think. Sick food? I or do you have, I don't, I don't think John I has one. a sick food. I don't I think do. so. I have two. One is a snack, one is a food. Every time I'm sick, you know how some people, every time they're sick, they want chicken noodle soup? Every time I'm sick, I eat this. Really? Yeah. I am drawing a complete Every blank here. time I'm oh, sick. Oh boy. I don't remember. I don't know. What? Mac and cheese. Oh, mac and cheese. That mac is my go-to sick food. It's like something I can get down no matter what, even if I'm sick. And my favorite snack is I eat the heck out of crackers when I'm sick. Oh, or crackers. even when I'm not. I love crackers. Yeah. I don't I mean, know that you is... have something that... No. I mean, you know, like other people have soup I get I've had that before like chicken noodle soup or something but I don't know that I have anything either in particular my mom used to always make mac and cheese well my dad you know I've talked about this before loved craft dinner and um, he w would eat that all the time and I just when I, so she would make that for him for lunch so if I ever stayed home sick there was mac and cheese and I think that's how it started oh, okay. for me like cuz I, I was like we have mac and cheese at home you know, I never knew yeah. that. I'm off having my school lunch. So when I started staying, when I was sick and I would stay home, there would be mac and cheese. And so oh. I just associate, I think, the two. Okay. Makes sense. Favorite candy bar. Oh, man. I know my, mine in an instant. Yours. 
Hmm. Do you know yours? I, uh, yeah, I, okay. I know mine. I'm going to say Milky Way for you. You're right. Okay. I'm going to say Reese's Peanut Butter Cup for you. Sadly. Even though you can't eat it. Sadly, I still dream about it. We're never going to break up. Me and Reese's Peanut Butter Cups, never, never. Um, okay. Favorite cereal? No. Uh, Boy, it depends on the day. Um, I'm gonna say Cinnamon Life for you. I do like that a lot. Um, you know the funny thing about John? Well, <laughs> nobody has time for that. One of the funny things about John <laughs> is that when we first started seeing each other, he was very set in his ways about food, I would say. I don't like this, I definitely like that, and I feel like um, because of the channel, maybe because of me, I eat different foods than maybe he was used to. His whole life he thought, I, you know, I didn't like this or I didn't like that. He always thought he didn't like cereal with marshmallows. And then he <laughs> ran out of his cereal the other night and we were going to have a snack. And I said I wanted to have a cereal. His was gone. So, you know, desperate times, right? Yeah, right. So he eats some of the cereal and he's like, hmm, I kind of like this. And I was like, what? We haven't had this kind of cereal in the house. Yeah, this whole time. I do love like um, Lucky Charms. I love the cereal pieces themselves. That's so good. And then I never liked the marshmallows. For one, I thought the taste was a little off. I didn't think it was, and the texture was off for sure. It wasn't like a marshmallow. It was like crunchy, and I didn't like the feeling of that texture on my teeth. Yeah, but, but this times time, are changing. That was good. Times was good. are changing. And you know what? It probably has very little, to, well, it could have something to do with me because I do eat th different things than maybe you ate before. But I also think as you get older, your taste change, right? Yeah. So, well, you know, with the channel, we try so much stuff that, you know, it just... Expands your horizons. Yeah, expands your horizons. So. Okay. So, what's my favorite cereal? Your favorite cereal Gosh, is, is going to be Frosted Mini Wheats. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> but Lucky Charms and Booberry, they're all tops. Okay. Last question. Yes type of food we're going out what type of food like pizza asian mexican hmm what are you what am i gonna pick i don't know john john likes it all i think mine is easy you do yeah okay i'll say mexican food for you you're right uh -huh. And I'm going to say, like, Asian, Chinese for you. I do love that. But he also loves Mexican. I do love that. So I think, I, I think uh, for me, Mexican food out, outshines okay. for Chinese just, just a hair. So. Okay. But I love so many of those uh, dishes, be it, you know, Hispanic or, or Asian. Mm -hmm. Love it. I think we tend to cook more with Mexican style flavors in our home. So, unless, I don't know, we cook a lot of Asian stuff too. I guess it just depends. What we haven't had at home in a while is usually what we get yeah, when we go we out. Yeah, or we have a taste for something. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. So, anyway, that was kind of fun. Let us know the answers that you have to any of these questions, your favorites. We're also doing this on the other channel, on the vlog channel, about favorite movies and bands and colors and some different things. So come to the new channel if you haven't already. We'll have a link for that as well as the game channel. We'd love to have you there as well. Down in the comments of this video, don't forget to find us on social media. Now, if you love stumping your spouse <laughs> or Stump. playing games or asking questions or finding out more about friends or us, or that video. Give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps our channel when you do that. That's all we have for today. That's it, guys. See you next time. Bye.